Authorities say a British woman is dead. Three other tourists are being treated at a New York hospital after a helicopter they were passengers in crashed moments after takeoff. It flipped over. It went, it went like this. It didn't break apart, propel it and flail all over the place. It just went around in circles and went right down. The accident happened Tuesday afternoon just a few blocks from the United Nations headquarters. A man who recently moved into the building across from the East River launch pad says he rushed to the roof of his building after hearing the crash. We see the back of the plane engulfed in the water and like we see like the two bottom pieces under it and all of a sudden we see what I think two people may have jumped in actually. Witnesses say people on the dock started throwing life jackets into the water where the pilot and three of his passengers could be seen bobbing up and down. Emergency crews pulled two women and a man to safety. The pilot, who was not injured in the crash, managed to swim to the shore. An hour later, a fourth passenger was pulled from about 50 feet of water. She was pronounced dead at the scene. The other women are said to be in critical condition. The man is stable. The passengers were friends of the pilot's family and had been visiting from Portugal and Australia. It's unclear exactly what caused the crash, but witnesses say the helicopter was sputtering before it went down. Apparently the pilot said he was having problems, tried to turn around and come back. But that may change as well. That was what we, what's been reported so far. The National Transportation Safety Board will listen to the ta- logs. I assume the radios were taped, and that someday they'll issue the story. A crane lifted the helicopter, which appeared to be completely intact from the water about four hours after the crash. It was loaded onto a recovery boat and taken to a police department field where it'll be examined by federal authorities. Brian Thomas, The Associated Press.